today is a good day to be a quarterback. Look at all these contracts that are being signed. Let's start it off with Tua. Tua signed a four-year, $212.4 million extension, uh, making him now one of the highest-paid quarterbacks in the NFL. A lot of controversy going on with him just being worth that much money or being a top-paid quarterback in the NFL. But, uh, you know, pretty interesting here. I'm curious to think what everybody thinks. And I think one that was definitely uh, a little crazy. I, I figured he was going to end up getting a big contract. I mean, congratulations on being a 500 quarterback. Um, I know he had a very good season last year, but it's it's a small sample size. We've only seen him play 18 total games, and now he's going to be the highest paid quarterback in NFL history. Absolutely insane. He also gets a $75 million signing bonus plus $155 million in new guarantees, which is just absolutely crazy. Um, I don't know if he's 100% worth this contract. Again, small sample size, 18 games that he's played in his career. And uh, to be able to get a four-year, $220 million contract is absolutely insane. And then here are just the rest of the, the top quarterbacks now, right? Now Jordan Love leads at $55 million. Lawrence, $55 million. Two is fourth highest paid now at 53.1. I mean, you look at a lot of these quarterbacks to me, Love, Lawrence, and probably Tua. I don't realistically think that they should be in the top five. Um, you know, I, I don't I think Lawrence is extremely overpaid. Obviously, Love for one season is overpaid. Tua is overpaid um, just because, of, I guess, really health concerns, if that's what we're worried about. But overall, I mean, hey, good for them. Good day to be a quarterback. But what do we think? Were they overpaid?